So some guys out there got the Westbrook rip, they got the Sox rip, you got this rip. Man, this is the Midwest rip. Let me show you how we do the Midwest rip. Mr. Finn style. Our rule is no picket less than half the width of one picket. So if I put this full picket up, what I'm left with is this narrow picket which would be less than half the width of one picket. So we want to do a double rip. You could measure the top and bottom, divide it by two, measure your picket over that dimension, top and bottom, trace it, do that twice and put it up there. That's one option. The other option is to nail both pickets in place and then do a double rip. Put the picket flush on the left-hand side, have the gap, take your next picket, put it flush on the right-hand side, Right like that, so it's flush right there, it's even, and put a nail through it, like that. Do the same thing on the bottom. So we have a nail up here, and a nail at the bottom. This edge is even, and this edge is even. We just need to rip right down the center of these two points right here. You can use a table saw, or we can use a circular saw. For our newer guys, I'd rather use the table saw, it's safer to rip that right down the middle. We would just set that deck right there. So we showed you how to do the table saw. I'm more seasoned guys can do it with a circular saw. If I start that saw right down the middle of that, I'm looking for a reveal to keep it the same. The reveal right here, quarter inch. If I keep it a quarter inch all the way, I'll be nice and straight with that picket. Now, there are two pickets, and this one's still nailed to it. Double rip. Nice deep cut. No measuring. 